Four minutes after the hour. Yeah, the storms moved through a few days ago, but now the impact is still being felt this morning as there's a lot of water. SRP releasing that from the reservoirs because they are almost at capacity. Allison Rodriguez live in Tempe where that lake is still closed. Uh, Allison, how long are we going to see this? Well, as long as it takes all the sticks and the plants to move through here, uh, the debris coming down the river and into the lake after SRP released water from upstream. The Salt River Project is letting that water flow after all of the rain we got here in the valley and that heavy snow up north, too. The Verde River and Salt River watersheds both at capacity, and all of that water has to go somewhere. At this point, the entire Verde water system is 97% full. Take a look at this. Horseshoe Dam is at 98% capacity. The Bartlett Dam, 97% full. Uh, water spilling over the Granite Reef Dam, flowing at more than 20,000 cubic feet per second. Essentially, that is a lot of water, and it does have to go somewhere, right? That's where we've seen some of those flooded roads, too. We are reaching out this morning uh, to find out how much longer the water release is going to take. Meantime, if you do want to come walk, run, or bike around the trails here, that is still going to be open, but all of the paddling and anything done on the lake, that is going to be closed until further notice. Uh, live in Tempe, Allison Rodriguez, ABC 15, Arizona. Good heads up there, Allison. Thank you. And